But the old boys have been consistent in their quest to continue to uphold the standard of their school. Well, great one there. Now, we move on to recognitions and award. The Nigerian Institute of Management has conferred the fellowship awards on some deserving members. Well, let's check them out. Honor, they say, is given to whom is due, and the executive of the Nigerian Institute of Management, NIM, is aware of that fact. And that's the reason they are honoring members of their association who, according to them, are befitting of a lifetime and distinguished fellow awards. In this hall are fellows, fellows elect, past and present executives, family and friends of the association who joined in this unique occasion. Today, we are here to celebrate both the old and new fellows of our great institute. We, at the Board of Fellows, concluded the exercise of choosing the best of eligible members to be upgraded to the fellowship of the institute. The Commissioner of Information, Aquaibom State, Anirkan Umana, Special Advisor to the Aquaibom State Governor on Technical Matters, Mr. Etido Inyang, and 47 other distinguished Nigerians from various fields were conferred with fellowship awards, which began with the Life Members Awards. <laughs> Looking for lack of Basura Shani woman, I am the bio. It was followed by the Distinguished Fellows Award. The award was conferred on members who have spent at least 10 years in the management cadre and have good records of service. Country manager of Congress. 
and his office was close to us here, a highly professional man, and uh, today he is still a professional manager because when he talked about the transformation that was going on in some of the states, he was one man that comes to mind. He was very quiet, but an amazing professional manager. We are very proud of this as we admit you to this place. With the latest confirmant, there are now 757 recipients of the award since February 1963 when the NIM was established. Well, first, I want to thank the Almighty God for the opportunity of this award and honor, you the opportunity of life, and uh, the opportunity of being celebrated today. I want to thank and especially appreciate my governor, His Excellency Chief Dr. Godfrey Lobod Abwabio, Commander Order of the Niger, for the work he's done in Akwaibom State, and for having confidence in me and the rest of us working with him and giving us a platform to join him in the uncommon transformation of Okwaibum State, which in the first instance even led to what NIM did today. I feel very elated and I, I want to say that Nigerian Institute of Management is one organization you know, that is uh, continuously, you know, preferring uh, excellence in management. The new recipients of the award were advised to see it as a call to higher service to the institute, management profession, and the nation at large. The process and procedures of uh, making fellows in NIM is very rigorous and uh, the outstanding Nigerians we pick, professional managers who are honest, corruption-free, and um, pay their dues not only to NIM but to the Nigerian society at large. So it's a great honor and privilege for me to bring this report to the public arena today, and I feel very happy. Later, there was a reception for family and friends of some of the recipients. To further celebrate this honor bestowed on them, they rounded it off by cutting their cake. Congratulations to all the recipients of the awards. Now we go on a short break and when we return, we shift attention to Kogi State for the burial of a renowned educationist, Professor Francis Idachaba. Stay with us.